Hello everyone this is Ultimate Public Entertainment. This Karen's energy changed immediately she realized she was being recorded. Take a look. We're going to be on we're going to be on social media. Hi everybody. This gentleman I'm trying to work Look how this lady media. just blocked me in. I'm going to I'll go ahead and move. I'll do whatever you want. We'll work together on it. It's no big deal. <laughs> okay, you don't have permission to share my face, my name. So you don't have to do that, sir. It's it's not necessary. What what's your name? What's your name from Go Go Moving in Beloit? That's what's your name, sir? Larry. Larry's your name. Hey, bud. Crazy Karen. Look at this lady. We were try right, we were gonna pull over. out. She couldn't wait for us. Right, got and everybody over. here seeing. There's plenty of room for all of us, sir. Larry, sure James, sure go moving of Beloit. There's sure. plenty of room for all of us. Sure and I was told right. I had to be here by two. I'm following directions from the. Yeah, but you were being rude room. from the beginning. No, I wasn't. Yes, I you were, lady. That's why I turned on the phone. I really, that's okay. And really you said crazy. that you didn't want to wait until we were done. I said that there was room for all You said you did not want to wait. We got a few things left on this truck and we could have been gone. You were impatient. You didn't want to wait, ma'am. I, I was not impatient. I said I would work with you, but now you're recording me. so I'm, gonna I'm recording you because you were acting crazy. Is this an example of false imprisonment? And do you think the driver should have called the cops? to handle Miss Karen. Let me know what you think in the comment section. A Karen was complaining about a UPS employee blasting music in front of a house. And guess what? She was put in a place. Take a look. Delivering to your house, right or wrong? And what did you say? No, it's not. It's not though. If it doesn't, in regards to your package, what are we talking about? No, now I'm going to sit right here till I'm ready, because who are you? You just came over here trying to tell me how to do my job on behalf of two other people who have nothing to say. Get whatever information you need, I don't I care. Don't you could call El Mondo, El Chop, I don't care about none of them. Like, how are you sitting here trying to, trying to tell me how to do my job? Do I come over here telling you how to do your job? Do your job. You I'm are. Keep the okay, but you yeah, just said on your... Work work no, I don't home. care. It's 5.30. If they're still at work after 5.30, then okay, that's fine. I'm still at work after 5.30. And this is how I do my job. So who are you to tell me how to do my job? I am one of your customers. Okay, I'm, I'm supposed to care? You represent. That's you, fine. You represent Amazon. I mean, that's fine. I know that. You know that. You came outside and set out your mouth. I personally don't have a problem with your music. Right or wrong? Right, right or wrong? So what are we talking about? Because I delivered you a package. So what are we talking about? I'm if you don't have a problem, then we don't have a problem. Talking You're talking about the volume on behalf of somebody else who came outside and said nothing. So therefore, there is no problem. Right or wrong? Wrong. I think that's right. You just said you don't have a problem. Right or wrong? <laughs> like you're still going. I'm going to sit right here and wait till I'm ready. I understand. You have a ring. All of that. The job got done. If they want to speak to me, I'll be more than happy to speak to them and apologize to them. But you, you just said you had no problem. So why are you trying to sit here and argue with me? Because you just came out. You came outside and you took time out of your day to bother me and talk to me, right? You did. You just stopped what I was doing and tried to say something on behalf of two people who aren't even coming outside to say anything. You're mad because you're getting ate up right now. Stop it. Just go ahead. Go ahead. Have a good day. Once you walk away, then I'll leave. Go ahead, because that's what you should have done. You should have stayed in your house and mind your business. All right, and you could have brought your... You didn't have nothing to say to me. You shouldn't have said nothing to me. It's that simple. 
If you say you don't have a problem with the way I just dropped off your package, we have nothing else to talk about, right or wrong. Okay, I don't like the loud music in front of my house. So then you should have started with that. But since you didn't, that's not the problem here. Next topic. Dave? Who is Dave? Call Dave. Hi, Dave. Like, come on, what are we talking about? Dave just waved to me. Look at you. You're mad. You're dumb mad. Red in the face because you are mad. Like, what are we talking about? Anything else you have to say? I'm just trying to make sure we get it all clear. This little fat dog. Ugly. Anyways. Wait a minute. Am I the only one that thought that the dog had nothing to do with the argument? Karen tries to save a parking spot by standing in it. You won't believe what happened next. Take a look. What is wrong with people thinking they can save a parking lot with just standing there? Like, are you serious? Thank you, ma'am. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes, congrats to me. Like, that's not how you save a parking. Hey, do not touch him. I'm recording you. All right. Hey, Tim. Hello. Here, give him that video. No, no, no. Yeah. Those charges. Just in case what? I'm not getting near you. You're the one getting near me. You see what? <laughs> You'll see why? Oh yeah, if something happens to my car, okay, my car is not damaged. If something happens to my car, it's her responsibility. Because she just said, just watch. She said, just watch. So there's absolutely no damage to my car. If something happens to my car, okay, then why did you say just watch? I don't care your car. Why did you say just watch? In the early 80s and 90s, holding a parking spot used to be a thing. But now... I don't think it's advisable for anyone to do it because you do not want to get hurt. This female officer claims to be intimidated by a guy's camera. Take a look at this. Six feet, so you're stepping up on me? Yeah, I'm stepping up on you because you okay, won't get out of my sir? way. You're okay. Well, yes. obviously, I'm, if, listen. What am I doing? Something sir? wrong? Yes, you're you're within six feet. Am I Excuse breaking? The, am I breaking sir. the law? Yes, you are. Am I? My I'm, personal space. Am I? I you touching me? You touching me? Touching no, you touching me. Sir, back up. Listen, I got it back on up, camera. Sir, thank you. Okay, I'm over here now. Thank you. Can I just oh, get yeah. some leaflets, take a pictures, and I'll be gone? Right. You want to? Can I just do that? You want to file your citizen complaint? Not right now because you're bothering me. Uh, well, you're a mistake. Do I, do I have anybody here know the, uh, my rights besides you? Because you obviously don't know. Okay. Okay, so I, I need to get those pictures, okay, because I have reasons for that. And I also want to get some information. There you go. Information okay, and, all right, so I will get that. Free, okay, then, so right over there, there can you get out the way so I can go over here and take pictures? No, I have to get out the way. You don't have to get out the way? No, I Okay, don't. well, can you quit blocking my way? Excuse me. Six feet. You see her, that lady went back there. She didn't want to tow my car for no reason. Okay, well. So who's I, her supervisor? I don't know who that was. That was, I, I can't remember her name, but oh, right now. Can't. No. Okay. But I, I got it. Sir, you said you wanted to follow I the said I want to take some pictures, get some information. To take your complaint. And I want to be left there. alone while I'm okay. doing it. I know one thing. Six feet. Sir, you step up on me. Don't touch me. So, don't you, touch my camera. Don't, don't step up on me. Well, you won't move back. You step up on me. You won't I move back. I feel intimidated and oh, threatened. Oh, you feel yeah, intimidated yeah. and threatened. So you hear back. this, y'all? Thank you. You got five officers here, and you feel okay, afraid you of a camera, me. huh? Step up. Don't step well, I don't. You know, we don't. don't know what you got. We don't need COVID. officers can't afraid can't of cameras. Can't okay. Can't we need somebody who's calm and collect and know what they're doing. Okay. Well, first of all, I just want you to know. Would you like to step over no, there? No, I'm going to tell you why I'm Sir, here for real. would you like to step over there? The other day I came here, Sir? your officers saw to me outside. They did? For no for the same reason. Oh, okay. So I came back to inside what to day? see. What day? That's irrelevant. It was a couple of days ago. Recently. What time? That's irrelevant. I came in here to see. Listen, Wait, I came in here to see if you guys were the same as the officers that were outside. 
and you worse. Uh -huh, I'm worse. Okay, okay. and everybody's going to see that. Matter of fact, you might be on the news tonight. Okay. Officer uh, Delaney, how you doing, sir? Good. You're the only officer here that's been civilized, so I'm going to give you some good shout-outs. Um, I'm in here because they violated me the other day, so I came back to get some information and to also see if they was going to violate me again. Okay, so you see, you were witness to what was going on. Okay, and I want you to know that I'm I will be the first person to slap somebody if they say something about the police. I appreciate police because I know they go out and, and take me every day. So I have to say that so let you know. Oh, now it's okay. Uh, okay, you want to talk to somebody? That's good. I really appreciate you. But at first, you was not doing this. You was you was being with her. Thank you. So, Officer Downey, like I said, that's that's what was going on, okay? Okay. And I appreciate you. I really do. After watching this whole clip, do you think this female officer needs to be retrained, possibly retire, or fired? Let me know what you think in the comment section. Who do you think is the Karen on this one? Take a look at this. We're ready to ride the ride. We're excited. No. Get off the ride. So everybody's going to wait for you. Period. I'm not going to ride till she gets off the ride. Because Period. I'm excited? Period. Period. I don't want to hear nothing until she gets off the ride. Yes, it's Everybody's going to have to wait until she gets off the ride. Period. What have I done wrong? day i think it's best to treat each other with respect period driver calls 911 on a police officer for allegedly violating his rights take a look at this drama are you in? I'm in Grand Prairie, Alberta, parked yeah. outside the hospital right now. I'm sitting in my vehicle and I'm keeping my okay. composure, but I want this guy to f off. Like, seriously, he's hey, given me a ticket for stunting just... because he heard me yelling at someone on my phone. And then I fingered him on the way out of okay. there and told him to mind his business and he's pulling me over for stunting again. I feel like driving away and starting a high speed sir. chase. This is over policing. Yes, yeah. sir, sir, sir. Just let me put you on hold for one second. Guy. There, I'm on the phone with your boss, you Kim. Stay on the phone. I'm just putting you on hold. Yeah. Constable Grant. Yeah. You, I'm on the phone with your boss now, you. You, I'm on the phone right now with your boss. You can try and bully me, you piece of. Good night. You. Sixty-seven dollars? Are you fucking serious? What a joke. Hi there. Hello. Hi. Hello. Okay. Um. There. There. There's another officer on the way to talk to you. Okay. Yeah. This guy can f right off. And he, this ticket, he can shove up his. F 
You can stay on the phone with me until the other officer gets here to defuse the situation. I no longer feel safe because of the little behind me. I will stay on the phone with you, okay? Thank you. I'm not I'm not trying to be rude to you, but this little behind me, I was having an argument on my speakerphone. Now I got a $600 stunting ticket for arguing because he thought I was calling him. Well, now I am calling Now I did hear him. And I ain't paying the ticket. And he off. Fucking little Do you see the finger again? Give me another ticket. And I'm crumpling up a ticket. You hear that? See your ticket? Crumpled up. I'd throw it on the ground, but you'd give me a ticket for littering. F*** you. And I'm not paying this ticket either. He can shove it up. I'll drive uninsured and That's unregistered if I have to. I don't give This is bull Send a supervisor. If you just send another friggin' stormtrooper, this is just going to escalate. Send a supervisor. Tell them you've been also, assaulted as a child by a police officer. I got for somebody to go. Yeah. Kim. No, I've asked for somebody to to get out there for you. This will definitely escalate somebody with some stripes. Who do you think is in the wrong on this one? Is it a driver for yelling on his phone at someone or the police officer for writing out a ticket to the driver for stunting? Let me know in the comment section. Finally, for this video, drama between neighbors over property line. Take a look at this. Are you going to bring it in here or are you going to put it out on the street? It's your choice. This is where your property ends, honey. Right here at your driveway. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. That's my light. Yes, it does. Sweetie. That's my light. Yes, it does. Can you sweetie. stop coming on my That's property? That's your light right th there. And then I'm calling the cop. On you, honey. I am calling the cops. I got no patience for a little unrespectful. You refuse to follow orders. Stop. As soon as you get that off of my property, I will stop. Okay? And mess up the rest of you, by the way. Now you're on my property. This is my property, hon. This is my property. You are still on my property. You weren't such a nasty little. Stop, you're breaking it. Oh, I'm breaking it. You're on my property. If you watched this video to the end, please do not forget to indicate in the comment section, as always, it's not that deep. Karen. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.